Uh, but is this all a, not a lot of nonsense? Yes. We all know from the Treasury's forecasts of the short-term impact of the Brexit decision that they haven't a clue, to put it politely. And so far as the longer-term impacts are concerned, these depend overwhelmingly on what are the policies we are going to put in place post-Brexit when we are free to do so. That is true, for example, of the agricultural sector, but it's true about the whole of the rest of the economy. And since these policies have not yet been decided, there is, is, there not, is it not the case that, that, there is, that this is a complete farce and that the opposition is simply seeking to embarrass the government in the face of, which is what opposition do in the face of an international negotiation?